Hey everybody, I'm here to get you guys started on setting up your hero board with uh, your Chromebook. Now, um, this is going to take a total of three steps. Uh, the first one, we're going to need to install a Chrome Web Store uh, extension called Arduino Create. Um, then we're going to go to the online editor to write the code for the hero board with the plugin. The last thing we're going to do is we're actually going to plug in the board and then obviously write a program to the board. So to do this, we're going to need to go to, first of all, like I just said, the Chrome Web Store, and we're going to download the Arduino Create installation. We're going to link this down below so that if you guys don't have a link for it, we'll link directly to it, or you can also find it just directly on the Chrome Web Store. We're going to hit Add to Chrome. We're going to add the application. And then you'll see that you can hit Launch App, or if you don't have that button in front of you and you want to access this again, again, the link will be on the screen, it's just the create.arduino.cc slash editor. Since I'm on a Chromebook, I'm gonna log in and make myself, make it a little bit easier for myself. I'm gonna log in with the Google authentication. And once you log in, it should bring you to a page that looks a little bit like this. Um, you'll notice up here, that there's should, probably nothing connected because um, we have not connected anything yet. And you'll see an editor with a big old text thing here and all this other stuff on the left, um, libraries, example code. And so what we're gonna do is, since we have the um, extension that was just recently installed, we're going to plug in uh, the hero board. Now we have three different boards here. Uh, if you have any of them that look like this or a blue one or et cetera, it should all work the same. Um, I'm gonna plug in just one of these here. And as you can see, um, it's everything's lit up and it is currently plugged in, powered on, and working. Um, and so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go up to this top section here, and you'll see that this just changed from, it said Arduino Uno, to with the little nothing plugged in sign to the Arduino Uno with something plugged in. The settings you're gonna wanna select for the hero board are going to be under fully supported. You're gonna wanna select under here, Arduino Uno, make sure the checkbox is there. And then the ports is dev TTY USB zero, and that's just simply saying, I'm going to be running it over the USB serial port. And you're gonna wanna make sure, again, check boxes next to both of them and then hit okay. And as you can see up here, it says, hey, we don't have any like misconnection error. So it should be, it's recognizing that it's connected over the serial port. And to confirm this, I'm going to go to the example code library here. I'm gonna click on basics and I'm gonna click on the blink code. And so what this blink code will do is it will take the onboard LED and it will blink it on for a second, off for a second, on for a second, off for a second, indefinitely for the end, until the end of the universe. So I'm going to hit upload, verify. And as you can see, it hasn't changed, but it will in a moment blink rapidly as it, the new software gets flashed to it. And as you can see, now that it's been done, you'll see this little LED on here is now going on, off, on, off every second, um, which means that it is able to connect to the board or able to connect to the Chromebook and upload everything successfully. Um, we can also confirm that by if I go down here and I'm just gonna real quick, for example, change this to 100 and change up the code a little bit. So instead of every second, it'll change to every 10th of a second. I'm gonna re-upload again. You should notice that it is now blinking much more rapidly and it is going on, off, on, off every tenth of a second, which means that hopefully you should be all set up and working properly with your hero board and now talking to your Chromebook. So hopefully all that's good and set up and thank you guys for watching.